Hey everyone, Don here for Sportsman's Outdoor Superstore, and today we're gonna to take a look at a new pistol to us in the warehouse. This is the Lone Wolf Dusk 19. This thing, uh, basically, it's just another one of those uh, Glock, um, I don't wanna say clones, but uh, maybe just a, a spin on a, a Glock 19. So, uh, it's actually really nice, some, some cool features. It comes optic cut up here for a Trojan Gun RMR, so it'll also cut fit the uh, uh, Holosun 407, 507, and 508, but not the K series. They make that very clear in the documentation. You have your uh, iron sights here is a blacked out rear, co-witnessable night sight front sight uh, from Night Fission. It's fission with an F, F-I-S-I-O-N. Yes, I can spell. Moving down in here, we have <clears throat> some nice chamfering on the top of the slide here. Uh, there are slide serrations in the front and in the back that are slightly angled to give you a better grip there. Then a little bit further down here, we have an extended beaver tail in the back, which is actually really comfortable to, to have up on your hand. Uh, but then we have the accessory rail up front, which has two slots instead of the one that you might see on a, on a 5 uh, or the uh, Kyger 9C, uh, which we're going to take a look at later on. Moving it down into the grip, it is a 19 degree grip angle, and it's really stippled nicely. It reminds me of a competition grip, uh, maybe something like a staccato. Then in the uh, trigger guard uh, area here we have the 90 degree flat face trigger here uh, for when it breaks a nice undercut right there and some extra room here to prevent the clock knuckle uh, a lot of these different uh, variations coming out with with that extended trigger guard there so a nice feature to have then we move down here into the magwell and it is flared out. It's got a little bit of a kick, a little bit of a toe here, and a little bit in the front as well. So, but it's it's not traditionally flared like you might think. Um, it is still pretty much just kind of a flat, uh, flat insert for the magazines, which are 15 plus one. It's a great looking pistol overall. So let's take a look and see how it compares to a Glock and a Kyger 9C Pro. All right, so for a comparison, we have the Kyger 9C Pro and we have a Glock 19 Gen 5. The Kyger 9C Pro, I only picked just because we have it on hand and it was easily accessible. I know there's other versions out there and other ones that we could go with. This is what I'm going with as a, as a quick comparison. So they all have similar barrel lengths, uh, 3.91, 3.9, 4.05. Again, very similar. Uh, overall length is just about the same. So for the Kyger 9 seats uh, optics, you have the cut for the RMR. Up top for the iron sights, you have suppressor height sights, which you can, you can use to co-witness through an RMR footprint that you have, um, which is really nice versus the Dust 19. Still a great option, which you can do with the lower third uh, witness through there. Uh, Picatinny rail, pick rail, Trigger guard extended out to prevent Glock knuckle. The grips are a little bit uh, extended for the Kyger 9C, which is something that you can do with the Glock 19 uh, with the extended, with the extra grips that you have in the case that comes with it. So with the Kyger, you get one mag. Uh, they're all 15 round mags, let me just say that. Kyger, you get one mag. Dust 19, you get two. And with a brand new uh, 19 Gen 5, you usually get three. Uh, plus the two back straps. With the Dust 19, you get one back strap. And with the Kyger, you get no back straps. So as of today, the pricing for a Dust 19 is going to be five, uh, about $530, depending on where you can find it. That's a very close price, depending, uh, especially since a brand new Glock 19 Gen 5 comes in at $540, again, at the time of filming. If you want something a little bit cheaper, that's still good quality, you can go with the Kyger 9C, which is $460 at the time of filming. Again, pricing can vary depending on the time of the year uh, and how long in the past that you're watching this. So, but if I had to choose, Glock has the reputation, uh, Anderson Manufacturing with their Kyger has the, uh, has the pricing, but I think I would actually go with the Dusk 19 because it's the Dust 19's video. It has 
It's optic ready, it's got the front night sight, which is awesome to see. The grip is really comfortable. I find it really appealing uh, with the way it's styled and the way it feels. The 19, uh, the 19 degree angle also feels just perfect. The flat face trigger is also pretty good. Uh, maybe I would swap it out, but overall stock, it's actually, it, it's still really good. Um, so if you wanna learn more about the Dusk 19, make sure you head over to our website. If you haven't followed us on social media, make sure you check us out on Facebook, X, Instagram, and YouTube, and make sure you like, follow, subscribe, all that good stuff. Thanks for watching everyone, and we'll see you in the next one.